Okay. So I'm back. That was unexpected. Did not expect the storm to be that strong, but hey. I'm back. Power's back. Streams back. Lights are on now because it's it was getting dark. Um Yeah. Uh the storm, I can still hear thunder. I'm just gonna warn you guys now, I can still hear thunder. Hopefully the power doesn't get knocked out again, but who knows at this point, really. Um fuck. Playtime zero? Oh, we're probably gonna have to start in the beginning again, aren't we? Alright. I was worried we were gonna have to start all the way from the beginning again, and it seems like that's the case. I didn't change any seconds, right? Maybe brightness, I think. I think brightness was the only thing that changed. But it's still how it changed it. Right. I was worried I was going to have to re-download the Everything game. Everything oh, that shit. lives is designed to end. We are perpetually trapped. In a never-ending spiral of life and death. That's why it's so loud. Is this a curse? Or some kind of punishment? I often think about the god who blessed us with this When everything puzzle. turned on after the... I wonder if we'll ever have the chance to kill him. also turned on the sound bar on my TV. This is Command. Your hot squadron, come in. To be here. All units have penetrated the stratosphere. Autopilot systems green across the board. This is Operator uh, 6 All units confirmed. We've passed 50 kilometer threshold and are proceeding toward the target. All these B units. Understood. In that one Once H you unit. reach their anti-air defenses, proceed to manual attack formation. Tight, then destroy yes. the Goliath class unit by any means necessary and gather the what they can. Understood. Leave to these like. Full name is like your unit to type B down. or some shit like that. All units activate manual mode and rely on visuals to evade. Already engaged. Free movement unlocked. Origin point of long range lasers confirmed. I have authority to perform, to perform that command. I'm trying to shoot, by the way, that's what's happening. But it's not letting me shoot yet. 11B down. Our HO229 cancelers are in effective. Alert. Enemy unit sighted ahead. Requesting permission to engage. Permission granted. Fire. Seven E down. Okay. Was that thunder again? Man, I hope I hope it decides to be gentle by my own I power think. Four so that, uh, you know, stream doesn't go down again. Listen, man, I just want to stream my favorite game, please. Two B to operator six O. All allied units down. The operation is compromised. Awaiting further orders. Uh, operator to two B. We need you to rendezvous with Unit 9S and begin gathering data on the local terrain. Understood. Oh god. Oh god, I wasn't paying attention.
Oh god, oh god, oh god, I was not expecting that. Activating short range attack gear. Alert. Large enemy group detected. Yes, I'm aware of that. Respect um, the, uh, the the fucking just like um, I, I, I respect the fucking absolute just fucking I don't courage and just like no fucks given attitude that Yoko Taro had with. Uh, I forget, I think it was like an interview or something where someone asked Yoko Taro, like, what's up with 2B's design? Like, why is she a girl? Or, like, you know, what's up with her, what's up with her design? <laughs> and Yoko Taro, Yoko Taro's response was like, oh, I'd like girls with big Not asses. Quite. And that's why 2B is the way she is. And, yeah, that's stupid, but I definitely respect his honesty. Is that our target? Negative. This enemy is unrelated. Proposal. Dispatch it as swiftly as possible. There was a... There was a girl in the first game who spent the entire game in the wrong way. And she was the best. Better make sure he's actually dead next time. That was dangerous, ma'am. You're 2B, yeah, 2B right? 9S, me. My name's 9S. I'm here to provide support. Copy that. So, was that big old buzzsaw the Goliath you came here to take out? No, just another defensive system. Oh, well, uh, I guess we have to find the target then, huh? I've got a flight unit, yes, so I'll take a look around the perimeter. Let's All right. Hope, uh, I'll work my way inside from the ground. The force of nature doesn't just fill my stream before I can finish the mission this time.
Uh, ma'am? What is it? I was going to send you the map data I collected earlier. Do it. Robots. We just skipped a bunch of shit. Oh no, 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 we're back. I am so lost. Nothing's ever easy. I just bought the first one I saw. And then, um, ever since I started using it, sometimes the screen would just, like, I don't know, just fucking glitch out. It's just like glitch out sometimes. System menu, yeah, so we can 
can't save now. But it is nice that this game does have a quick save option. On map mode, there's the map, map icons. Let's just take a look around here real quick, I guess. Quests. Items. And a small recovery, medium recovery, large recovery. Yeah, so no valves, no file, no herbs, no vials, no uh, potions, just, just recoveries. And they attack up, and they defense up. All this will work. Alright, so then that's that. Right, so. Well, look at this shit. Look at this shit later. Alright, look at that shit later. It's, um. Cosmic shit. Uh, weapons. I only have two weapons. I do appreciate that you can fight barehanded in this game. And I think there actually is a whole weapon set, like a whole weapon type around it, which I completely fucking forgot about. Um, yeah, combat bracers. Um, so all, all I have right now is two swords one small sword, one large sword. Um, the whiskers and on that person. I can go over here dude, should I choose uh, programs and plug and chips. So this is a thing with this game. This is how you basically create your build. You get chips that provide bonuses and you only have a, a limited amount of um, space for each one. And this is uh... This is where you, you fucking equip them. It's an interesting um, way to do that, for sure. Alright, you know, we got fucking like beast theory essentially. I'm not I'm not gonna read all these, but I will show off the models because they're nice. Look at the small stubby. And then the medium by pen. Look at the look at the medium by pen. And the small flyer. Wow. Look at that. And the medium flyer. This is the, the perspective we saw again. This is here. Special units. The fucking slug leg. Alright. And then the system menus. you're here. Why? Scanners like me mostly work alone. Scouting out enemy lines and all that. I don't usually get a partner. It's kind of fun. Emotions are prohibited. <laughs> Sorry, ma'am. And another thing. Stop calling me ma'am. Huh? It's unnecessary. All right, then. To be it is. To be it is. This place sure is big. I see this before. I guess humans used to use it as a weapons factory, but now it's just crawling with machines. Sure 
The enemy seems to have repurposed the facility to increase their overall machine production. So if we don't destroy it, they'll just keep coming. Accessing random, nonsensical data from the old world. There's no actual meaning behind anything machines do.
Analysis. This elevator's controls are locked and cannot be used. Alert. Bulletproof apparatus detected on enemies. Close range combat is advised. I know. These motherfuckers are bulletproof now. Surveyed the entire factory, but couldn't find anything resembling our target. Maybe they, I don't know, moved it somewhere? Hmm. Is that? You mean the birds? Yeah, there's more plants and animals here than there used to be. Probably because the environment's changed. So now there's, like, you know, we, we got, you know, the environment's coming back. The environment's recovering a bit. Thing around here. I can show us what's keep going up, but I just want to make sure there's anything. I know I saw something off in the distance over here. Oh, over here too. Crystal. Oh, is that where I'm supposed to go? Objectives out there. Looks like. That guy's supposed to keep going up. Hold on. Huh. There we go. Oh, there's no way to go up. That way's blocked too. Never mind. I'm a dumb. Alright. Think we're fucking think I'm missing anything, but Yeah, I'll see. oh wait, there's a chest I think. Yeah. Medium recovery. There should be another facility across that bridge. It's a bit of a hike, but should we check it out? It's not like command to get a location wrong. I guess even they get bad intel from time to time, huh? Maybe. Hmm. I wouldn't bet on that.
dog while you do this. Target enemy detected. You guys are for some hype shit. It's about to be a real hype. The whole fucking stage. The whole fucking stage was the big machine. It was the, the whole fucking stage was the giant machine we were. <laughs> This is the target. I'm going to destroy it. Uh, right. I'll provide support. Yeah, this is really cool help, actually. Alert. Incoming enemy attack from below. Yeah, Proposal. So big here. Boost! Nine S. Nine S. Nine S black box signal detected. No response to communications. I'm going after him. So they have black boxes like, uh, like planes, I guess. Um. Oh, shit, he's it dead. It's not dead yet. Send a support request to command. Negative. Communications have been jammed.
certain high maps is important, but like when there's boobies to be had, it's just like I care. gel and logic virus vaccines then access them inadvisable the subject's vital signs are too poor to attempt field repair shut and up current... just do what i say to be just go me you shut up too we we're soldiers we take pride in our service oh. HO-229 Flight Unit, Command 677 received. Usage rights transferred from 9S to 2B. Requesting acknowledgement. Please. If he got fucked up in that head, why didn't his, uh, his right. fight suit also got fucked up? Because he got fucked up when he looked him. <clears throat> Right? Like... You got fucked up. Yes, let's go. I forgot about this. Talk 
about Minus. bringing the battle to them. <laughs> Only known you a short while ago. Ought to be. Contact command. Request assistance. Days. No. It doesn't look like that's going to be necessary. There's two more. Oh, shit. Three more, even. Oh, great. Wow. Fuck. You got fucked up just by one. Mine us especially. I don't imagine that. Uh, that dude got fucked up. <coughs> this is going to end well. The black box. It's ready. Right. Requesting destruction of enemy hostiles via black box reaction. Request accepted. Doobie, it was an honor to fight with you. Truly. The honor was mine. Fucking blown, blown themselves up, blowing up their black boxes for uh, for the sake of their mission. <laughs> oh shit, we're in space. Yeah, yeah. So this is where you really start to see the differences between uh, this game and the first game. First game was more was more fantasy. This game is, is a little more sci-fi. You're in fucking space, dude. Your hub area is a space station. I forget what all these icons on the map. Fucking quick save map. Which means I can do this, actually. You guys want to dig an ending right now, real quick? Because there's an ending you can get. I mean, right as soon as the game starts, you can get this. But I want to make sure I can save first. You'll, you, you'll see what I mean. So remember how I said... Um, these chips... Um... Show you, um, to sh like, you know, they, they show you shit. Like, th these chips is basically how you build your character. Uh, well, you start with a bunch of them. Um, I didn't realize th that these chips were a thing. Well, anyway, uh, shit like, you know, your HP gauge, your skill gauge, enemy dagger, mini map, uh, you know things on your HUD, so you can one hundred percent just disable your HUD for more points, to so you can get like other chips in there if you want. So like if you don't want the text log, you can take that off, put something else. If you don't want the mini map, you want enemy data, take those off. You can put you get more points for other shit. Um, if you don't, if you want to get rid of uh, the HUD marking, save points for you. Boom. You don't want to see damage values done. Get rid of it. Um, so like, actually, so like, fine. So can I see, actually, can I see my health gauge right now? I can. All right. So let's say I want to get rid of, um, let's, let's get rid of, um, the health gauge and let's get rid of, um, the mini map. Why the fuck not? Right? And boom, just like that, they're gone. I don't know if this game has a fog on actually. 
I imagine this would be really good for like, um, like fuck them over, taking screenshots and shit. Um, however, you also may have noticed this. She will see soon. Hold on. Me. System. Let me put the fucking. Fucking, uh. HP gauge and minimap back on. You also may have noticed this. This OS chip. So there's all these HUD stuff, right? There's also an OS chip. An Android central system. Removal means death. You can remove it. So let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Surely it'll stop me, right? No. It, it doesn't stop you. <laughs> Caution, handle with care, removal of the OS chip will result in death. And there's the credits. Wow. Fatal error. So that was ending T. Yep. That's that's technically an ending. Boom, right there. One ending down. Nice. First stream, first stream, and it was even interrupted by uh, force of, so forces of nature outside of my control. And we we still got an ending. Look at that. I'm just I'm just that good. I am just that good. But anyway, that's why I say it, because you do actually die. You get an ending. You get ending T. And uh and uh yeah. Um I should also mention no. There aren't ending there aren't that many endings in this game. There aren't endings A through T. It's like A through D or E, I think. I think D. There might be an E. I, I don't remember. But and T is just a, a little extra thing. But look, we we technically we technically hit credits. We technically hit credits. I have to look up the uh I'm gonna have to look up the uh the guy I used to to make my um can't go in there yet. To make my uh my logo, my chip logo. So I did use a guy to just you know, see what other people do. Oh shit, it's nine us. So Mission complete and all that, we huh? We both survived. The Goliaths were wiped out, and we secured a route into enemy territory. Now we can... 9S. Yeah? Thank you for uploading my data to the bunker. Ah. Uh, um, I So their that. bodies were destroyed, but they Sorry, had uploaded I don't remember. their data to the bunker. There wasn't so. a whole lot of bandwidth down and there, And they were backed know? up. They're robots, I probably right? only had enough time huh. to back up your memories. Mine are only intact up to the point just before we rendezvoused. I see. Mm. So my ass doesn't remember everything. Glory to mankind. Glory to mankind. This game uses online functionality for its message sharing features connected to the network. I forgot about this. I don't even remember exactly how it works, but that sounds kind of like a Dark Souls like message type thing. Yes, see if I can find this. Fifty twelve AD. Fifty twelve. The year mankind's glorious history came to a sudden and abrupt yeah. end. 
Yeah, that, that's when much the world later was than by aliens first one takes place, the I think. Stars. The aliens there's unleashed been, a new breed of weapon, machine-like force, that all but annihilated the human civilization. The handful of survivors that remained fled from Earth, seeking refuge on the moon. 5204 AD. Humanity launched its counterattack, deploying an army of androids from a network of orbiting bases. But after more than a dozen large-scale descents upon the enemy, we still haven't managed to repel the invaders. That is why you, the Yorha forces, exist. To break this stalemate, once and for all. You are our ultimate weapon, and you must put an end to this war. Understood, sir. I wish you good hunting. Glory to mankind! Glory to mankind! Glory to mankind. All right. So yeah, aliens came and shot a bunch of robots, a bunch of machines onto uh, onto Earth. I started killing people. First, I want to check your brightness settings. Um, and fucking just killed shit ton of people, and the remaining people fled to the moon. And started sending androids to the Earth to to fight against the robots. You don't know how to adjust the brightness. I think it's set up to respond to some kind of input. Just only if the right icon is visible. I mean, already. Alright, let's get started. We'll go through each adjustment in order. Start by getting the brightness set. I'm trying on this, goddammit. Not good. Not good. I'm trying to see. Alright, I should look up the stream to make sure it looks good for you guys. That should be fine. That should be fine. That's okay. You know, I should probably let you know that the entire process is being recorded for posterity. Now let's take a look at your voice recognition system. Seems your voice recognition is set to mute, which isn't going to work. I'm going to call it to you now. Make sure you can hear my voice. Ma'am? Are you there? Can you hear me? I can hear you. Uh... Hello. Kind of. But my, Go my ahead and adjust TV your settings so you can hear me, all right? Kind of low just so the mic doesn't pick uh, it up. Adjust the settings until can you hear can you. hear my voice. I can hear all you. All right. Are we good now? Yes. No. I'm fine. And that's there's something calming about your voice. Let's see what he says. Oh. Uh, oh thank you. Anyway, that takes care of the settings. Hold on. Your self-destruct permissions are missing. Self-destruct permissions? Wait a second. We need to restore those. I could set it for you, but you should probably do it yourself. Regulations and all, you know? Yeah, it's, it's, it's okay, turn on self-destruct. What the If fuck things not? go wrong during an op, you may have to sacrifice yourself in order to finish it. So, once you're finished making adjustments, you can go ahead and close this out. So, I never use a self-destruct once. In my uh, in my original playthrough, and um, I'm not really sure if it's actually any useful. Like, I'm not really sure if it's useful at all. Morning. The commanders put me in charge of your maintenance, ma'am. That means I'll be performing regular checks on you from now on. I see. Oh, don't worry. 
We 9S models are the best around, you know. Though I suppose we're not exactly known for our modesty. 9S. Hmm? What is it, ma'am? Stop calling me ma'am. Huh? There's no need to be so formal. Uh, all right. If you say so. Oh, I almost forgot. The commander was calling for you. We better go see what's up, ma'am. Er, to be. Fucking self destruct right here. You want to take a break? No. I believe that boots you back up to the main menu. I'm gonna adjust my combat style. My balance is fine. We'll wait till we get in the area in call it. The game does teach us how to self destruct with here. I already know how to do it because I, I play the fucking game. But when, once the game teaches us all, oh, that's when I'll actually fucking do shit. Sound waves. Interesting. XP gauge. XP gauge might be nice to have. I don't know if it's really necessary though. Spots might be nice out too. I mean, I only have enough for two of these chips, so I, I'll go with XP. And fishing spots. And I'll buy, buy some recovery potions, yeah. Buy like five of you and like. Three of you. Do I have anything so? No. Actually, can I sell the auto? Yeah, I'm gonna sell the auto stuff because I'm not. I'm not gonna fucking use these. I'm not. I'm not gonna fucking use these. So those one. What the fuck does this do? Doesn't say. All right. Under where? Uh, small stubby, got more shit. Actually, I think we can. <clears throat> oh, I forgot you can animate them. I have to fucking punching you right, squirt right in the fucking face. And then, fire. And shielded one. Okay. We've got medium bipeds. It's fucking punch. You just got the punch. Yeah, okay. And ones with the shields. Got a shield bash. <clears throat> Look at the animations for these fuckers. It just shoots. Yep. Same shit. Alright, then there's this fucker. Uh, the special unit machines have unreadable names. This fucker. Fucking cool. God, it's fucking cool.
That's cool. That's neat. I like that. Oh, you can look at the animations for this one, actually. Check my mail. Check it here. You need to be near an access point to save your data. You can see access points on the close range map. Be sure to save often. Will do. Select the inbox at the an access point to check your mail. Server manager test mail. Uh this message is intended for the verification of your mail account. Members who encounter problems with the mailing system should contact the supervisors as soon as possible. IT operations league server engineer. Cool. Let's fucking save real quick. Why the fuck not? Alright, that's where I need to go. Continue. What else you got? This is six O's room. She's not here, or he. I forgot to equip the fucking things. The chips I just bought. The uh, the pod is basically this game version of Grim Grimoire Vice, and this is where all the pod spells go. Bullets. Oh, that shoots much faster than than uh, Dark Blast. And not quite a dash here, but it serves uh, the same function essentially. Hello there. You're starting to get quite the reputation. Oh, but don't worry, it's all good. I you used your black box to blow up those goliaths was so awesome. Uh, try not to actually die, okay? We'll take good care of your data, so make sure to upload it frequently. Okay. Open for command, just head on the public left. The registration room is on the right. Take care. See you around. Oh, they were both talking. I didn't realize that. And the, icon, the little icon over their heads switched back and forth depending on who was talking. Let's look in 9S's room. Oh my god, we're in a boy's room. How fucking crazy. I'm fucking stupid. Um, there's another fucking save thing. Five O's room. I have all five O. I'm gonna take your shit. Don't mind me. Defense up S. Cool. Hey, have you been using your recovery items? Everyone on the R and D team is really proud of them. You can even buy them from the terminals in your quarters. Give them a try. Can you say anything else? And what's that? You'd like to see a greater variety of items for purchase? Hey, I got you. But that's just how it goes. We're trying to develop more. But for now, that's what you see is what you get. Fair. Fair enough. 21 the level. Take your shit. I believe that's the terminal to leave. I believe that's the where you go when you want to leave. Wait, whose room is this? 8B. Or a soldier and operator. Hello. 
I was just talking about all the plant animals I saw on Earth. Operators are kind of nuts for dax collection, you know. It makes me jealous of the combat troops. I'd love to go down there and collect the dax myself, but they don't allow it. Hey, I'd take you if I could, but, you know, I don't like the rules. I love hearing about Earth, but the most important thing is seeing everyone come back safely. That includes you guys, okay? So be careful. I mean, we blew up ourselves. We we blew ourselves up last time, so maybe we should be careful. Seven B. She in here? She's sleeping. I think. I think that's her sleeping. I. I think her head is clipping into her pillow. You might. You should, you should probably. I don't know if that's dangerous. For your head to be clipping through your pillow. Like that. Hmm. Oh. I never get tired of looking at Earth. The hangar? You can get to it from the yellow later tomorrow. I hope we can return to Earth soon, some, together with mankind. that day when she gets motion sickness. No matter how many times you repair the sense the problem comes back, it's almost like it's in her head or something. You guys take care of yourselves. Don't end up like her, alright? How you feeling? Ready to get back out there? The whole world is still spinning. Where I go? I'll make sure I can tell the commander that you're not fit to use flight units for a while. Alright. Hey there, you going to Earth again? I give almost anything to spend more time in the flight unit. We go like that, but they're expensive, deadly pieces of equipment, so they don't just hand them out willy nilly. The new combat types are the worst. Last time I used the flight unit, it came back with huge scratches on the side. I mean, we get, we get into combat. It's, it's literally in our name. Who do you think fixes that, huh? We do. We work our fingers to the bone to get you a beautiful ride, and you go and crap all over it. All right, all right, I get it. Sheesh. Flight units are great, but doesn't R&D just install wings and jets right on our... But why doesn't R&D just install wings and jets right on our bodies? That's a great idea. Then you can stop damaging my precious flight units. Yeah, I asked about that once. They said it would put too much strain on our bodies. Also, something about it not being financially feasible. Ah, they would say that. There's gonna be a lot of talking to NPCs in this game. By the way, I should should warn you. Just like there was quite a bit of talking to NPCs in uh in Route A of first game. We're back at my room. My room. You know what? What do we have over? Let me see where this leads up to. Because uh... <clears throat> I think the hangar is actually where you go to uh... do shit. Where does this go? To like go to Earth. So where does this go? It also goes up into this area. Nearly attack up. Oh, shop. Maintenance shop on her. You get any maintenance done? You come to the right person. So, yeah, this is where I can buy. Um. Oh, fuck. I should have bought these. <laughs> fuck, I can't realize. Oops. <laughs> Upgrade my, my chip storage as much as possible. Uh, but yeah, you got more shit. Laser, we have Mirage. I remember this being pretty useful sometimes. Hammer. Blade. Uh, is essentially, um. 
like spiral swords um what's it called uh dark whirlwind i think is what it was called in uh replicant spear is like dark execution i think it was called where you summoned all the, the fucking spears from the ground uh shield is you pick shield was p shield and blocks melee attacks and then m shield blocks projectile attacks which is weird that p shield blocks melee then m shield blocks projectiles or whatever and then storage upgrades for your chips i'm gonna try to upgrade my chip storage as much as possible i mean i'm good with laser honestly i'm good with laser laser is really good so then upgrade i can upgrade my pod um, upgrading your pod also requires materials. Fuse. You cannot fuse this chip because you have no chips of the same ability and rank. Okay. I don't remember fusing, but. I guess he can fuse chips to get a bag of chip. Excuse me. All right. <clears throat> now let's move forward. Seeing smoothly, there's no, there's no sign anyone's noticed any. What's your problem? Get on my Facebook. I rearrange you. Jesus Christ! All right, I'm just trying to fucking, just trying to make some friends. Back off. This is none of your business. Yeah, just a minor noise. Doesn't get your undies in the twist over. Hey, didn't you hear me the first time? Make like a machine and get and get out of here. Okay. Um. Damn. What a bitch. What a bitch. I believe this just takes me down. Yep. Sure does. Got a lot of operators talking. Hi there, boy. You two are thick as thieves, aren't you? I know you're only working together by coincidence, but it's nice that you've become friends. I'm used to engaging in missions on Earth. There's only so much we can do from here, but we'll back you up as we can. Good luck. Thank you. Are you checking your mail regularly? Sometimes support mails sit around for weeks because the recipient doesn't know how to check them. Don't be that person. Check your mail regularly at a transport terminal, right? I feel like it's a direct attack on me because my current email inbox is just fucking wild. I, I, I honestly, I don't, <laughs> I don't check my email as often as I should. Um, yeah, I have so much bullshit in my inbox right now, it's not even funny. There's a giant piece, what, well, one of the giant pieces of advice, I, I, fuck, one of the giant pieces of advice from someone who's been in your shoes before, back up your data whenever you can. If you do that, it doesn't matter if you lose your body. You can just upload the backup data to a new body and be on your merry way. How may I assist you? Please keep it brief. You still here? You should be turning to your duties. I'm coming for a party for disobeying orders. Damn, dude. Oh, 21 0. I went into her room. I don't know if her room was one of the ones where I, uh, took shit. Your body is automatically registered information from sign enemies to the database. It was a practical design decision to allow combat engines to also collect intelligence. Cool. Yes, do you need something? If not, it's just conserving your energy for more important matters. Fair enough. Can I talk to you, Oregon? Yeah. Anything 
back here. That's a thousand gold. Nice. Eating something? No? Alright then. Ah, I'm so tired. Me too. Me too. Oracle will do that to you. This is the bunker. Go ahead. Say it, say it again. <clears throat> oh, this is the bunker. Go ahead. Go ahead. Wait, fuck. This is the bunker. Go ahead. Say it again. You lost your pod? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yes, I see. Well, a lost pod will emit distress signals, so try to locate that and then search the surrounding area. Chunk her out. Maybe... <laughs> Oh my god, I feel this so much. This is what this is for all you fucking Karens out there. This is what it's like for people in retail to deal with you fuckers. Alright. We fucking as soon as we're done dealing with you, we we fucking yell about you to our fucking to either just the fucking ether or to our closest coworker. And it's just like, well maybe don't lose it next time, honestly. And then, you know, on for us. It's probably, you know, there's probably some swearing involved, but you know, but you know. I doubt there's any Karens actually watching. Can I? Wait, I can lock on to them. Do I dare attempt to attack? Although, they're sorry you had to hear that. But yes, apparently one of my units managed to misplace her pox somewhere in, in the desert. If you haven't defined it, make sure to get a good home, alright? Can I walk on to everyone? I can. Weird. Did you know you can install plugin chips to improve your body's performance? If you want to install a bunch of chips, go talk to the S Type Mogul in the server administration room. Plugin chips remain in your body after you die. So don't forget to recover your body if you want them back. What? I think I vaguely remember something like that. Or like you could recover your your corpse, kind of like Dark Souls, I think. Fuck, there was so much, so, so much of this game I don't remember. I say, I have a question for you. Are you using your pog effectively? Random, I know, but the thing is, you can install these things called pog programs that will show you special attacks. There are a bunch of different ones, so start tinkering and see which works best for you. Well, once you find the program you like, don't forget to set it. Alright. Hey there, how's it going? Majestic trees, pretty flowers, cute little animals, I love it all. Um, is there a problem? Like, I forget to upload install or something? Uh oh, I'm gonna get yelled at again, huh? Don't, don't worry about it, 6 I got your back. I got 6 just trust me, I got, I got your back, I got your back. So, oh. Alright, let's head down. Three thousand gold. Close a lot of people. They're so obsessed with giving orders, they forget to provide details about the actual mission. I hope we're going to be okay. Still, I'll be managing things once everyone's on there, so at least I know that part will go smoothly. <clears throat> go regular mankind. Listen up, the future of the human race is on your is, on, is in our hands. Now get out there and complete your missions. If you come across any machines, show no mercy and great no quarter. Their evil must not be forgiven. Glory to mankind. <clears throat> Are the soldier units female? Just like a commanding officer, my dream is to kill scores of machines and contribute to humanity's great victory. Glory to mankind. Fighting isn't really my thing, but they assigned me to combat duty anyway. I wonder if I can transfer to being an operator. Are are your are sorry, are your huh units just are aren't are they not just built for their task or are they built then just assigned to a task afterwards? I I, I would think they'd be built for the task that they need them for. 
complaining officer loves formalities. Me, I'd rather just get the orders over with and start the mission already. Excuse me. Sorry about that. <clears throat> This unit was only manufactured recently, so she's still quite nervous. You are a fully fledged operator until you can summarize information accurately and concisely. She can relax a little though, I'll cover for her. My partner after all. She's my partner after all. You guys know what that's like. That concludes your mission summary. As for the detailed breakdown, the first thing to remember is um, unless something is literally on fire, please go away. I'm in the middle of a crit of critical mission briefing. You know what? That's fair. I shouldn't be bothering you while you're trying to give uh, a couple Yorka soldiers their fucking mission. The operators try hardest to explain everything, but I'm still so confused. I just hope I don't get in anyone's way. Yeah, sorry, but I don't really get it. Can you explain it again? Maybe you go a little slower that time? This time. Man, these operators are so fussy. Wish they just get me the dagger I need and let me do my thing. My partner seems tense. Do you think it's something I did? Uh, who knows? <laughs> oh, how goes the mission? If you need additional mission intel, you can find it on your HUD. Certain plugging chips can also help you out. We're collaborating with the resistance to gather and sell and help our troops win the war win the war for Earth. We're happy to be of service. <clears throat> you were fantastic in that battle the other day. I'm looking forward to seeing what you do next. Oh my gosh, the day this day is lasting forever. Okay. Only the commander can improve communications with the Council of Humanity. Your high soldiers aren't allowed to make individual contact. For the most part, I'm the operator in charge of, communica of communicating with the Council. They don't contact us much, so most of my job is just keeping them up to date on the latest Earth happenings. They must really trust us, huh? Yeah, I guess so. Don't worry, I can take care of myself. I've got plenty of recovery items. Uh, look, I'm grateful that people are concerned about me, but at some point they need to just let me go on the mission. Are you feeling alright? Do you have enough recovery items? Are your vital signs? It's critical to deal with injuries right away. I'm, I'm so worried. Maybe I should talk to one of the operators and, re and request a model change. What? <laughs> To talk to these ones. All right, let's talk to the fucking commander. <clears throat> ah, ah, 2B. 2B. Maintenance finished? Oh. Yes, commander. This voice actor. You detonated your black box in order to defeat the enemy. Bold, but risky. Try not to be so no reckless promises. next time. Understood. I know you're fresh out of maintenance, but I have another mission for you. I need you to head to the surface. Rendezvous with the Resistance and do some recon. Doesn't Yorha have a dedicated Resistance contact already? We haven't been able to get in touch with them. So we'll need you to look into that as well. Understood. <clears throat> okay. We need to get in touch- in- fuck, we need to get in touch with the contact. <laughs> The surface? That means we'll be getting flight units, huh? Better head for the hangar. <laughs> Usually we can't. Hmm. Get near flight units. They're way too expensive for us grunts. Too bad they can't mass produce these things yet. <clears throat>
The hangar's up ahead. Let's go. Let's go. Pretty sure. Yeah. All right, let's head down to Earth. <clears throat> hey, 2B, why do you think they sent a combat model like you to a recon job? If all they want is intel, we scanner models are built for that kind of thing. Orders are orders. All right, all right. QB, you're going to have some new weaponry installed from here on out. I'll put up instructions for you. Make sure to commit them to memory. Roger. Missile bro. from the resistance camp, unfortunately. Up. Sorry for the trouble, but we can't risk the enemy discovering their position. Understood. Good luck down there. And here we see another huge difference between this game and um, the first game is the change in environment. The environment in this game is much different. Target location acquired. Marking on map. Proposal. Proceed to target location. Main map shows geography around your current location at the bottom right of the screen. The icon shows your objective to make sure you f so make sure you follow it if you don't lost. Yep. <clears throat> Inside here. No, this area is pretty dark. That goes down right over there. Let's see if I can jump over here. See what's wrong here. Right? Yeah. 
thought there were machines in here, but maybe not. So pretty. Oh. I had no idea. I'm sure I must have, like... I must have figured this out at some point might have been a place where I, I forgot about the pod's flashlight. Also, I just realized I haven't heard thunder in a bit, so I think we're in the clear. or anything. Hmm. Oh, just... So, many fucking floors. Yeah, there's robots on there. How many fucking floors does this fucking building have? <laughs> huh. They're not attacking. I don't remember if I attacked them in my original playthrough or not, but they might drop cookies. Doesn't have to go. They had to go. But listen, the aliens drop them here to wipe out humanity. That makes them the enemy. Cyclists. Hypothesis. Jamming caused by enemies in local vicinity. What was this? Map information unlocked. What's an access point? Okay. Map data obtained from bunker. Data may be displayed from the system menu. Map data. Interesting. Hard to get an accurate picture from this. According to our intel, none of the machines in this area are hostile. We've been seeing more and more enemies like this lately. They just stand there and stare into space. It's pretty weird. We also got some an animals. Look, moves. Oh god. Oh god, it's pissed. I didn't even do anything. It's already pissed. Oh. 
Oh, you think you can just fucking charge at me and get away with it and just run away? Fuck that, get the fuck over here. Right. Got your meats, bitch. Don't fucking charge at me next time. like hell. Let's just get to the fucking camp. There's a side mission over there. We can get to that later. Stuff side missions around here too. We can we can get to those later. For now let's get to camp. Let me go up with the resistance. That is not the right way. Apparently. Guess I gotta go around. Do huh. kinda wanna check out what that is. But Fucking check them out later. This is the resistance camp, huh? We should probably go talk to their leader first thing. Let's save her. Okay, all save points don't heal you in this game. Good to know. Okay, so. First things first. Let's look at some cosmetics that I have because of DLC bullshit. Um, which are kind of cool. Yeah, um, play system pod shaped after a common household appliance vital for survival yeah can I fucking identify let me fucking see your face motherfucker and there's no like Pokemon huh to something or someone and can I there he is there's the pod yeah he looks like a fucking PSX I mean you can there we go yeah he looks like a fucking PSX um Then we got the Grimmar Vice, a high capacity device used in the Gestalt project. <clears throat> it exudes a vague aura of pompousness. That is Vice. So, yeah, Vice. He gets up and he shoots, he does shit. And this is Vice. It looks a little small, I think. But I guess it is the pod. 
so. Okay. Uh. Guess we got the cardboard pod. He's, he's made of cardboard. Rag pod. Is this supposed to be a fucking Famicom? I think it's supposed to be a Famicom. Interesting. I interesting. Especially considering that this game never came out on the on any Nintendo console. Not even the Switch. Pretty sure this game would run like shit on the Switch. Where was that? Here we go. Retro Grey Pod. This might be like, I guess the SNES. The Ameri an American SNES. Because the Super Nintendo here was like gray. And this it. It's like gray and like a very, very uh, dull purple. Like purplish color. Yeah, they can let us have fun over here with, with our Super Nintendos. <clears throat> um, a Mazarashi head. A strange pod with three eyes. It looks at, at you as if it thinks it deserves to live. I don't know what the fuck this is. I'll be real honest. I don't know. I don't know what the fuck this is. I don't know if it's a reference to something. I don't know if it's just... Yoko Taro and or Platinum Games being fucking weird as shit. Uh, a machine mask. A head covering worn by machine life forms. And I can just have my little machine mask. Yeah, for the sake of the playthrough, I'm just since it's the first playthrough on stream, I'm just gonna play. Uh, just like when you're up, okay, I'm just gonna play with the regular, the default skins. Uh, let's see. Oh, one more thing. I am gonna have to end it soon because uh, I don't work tomorrow, unfortunately. Very, uh, very unfortunately. But <laughs> you guys want to see what self-destruction does? Because I don't know if there's any actual, like, practical use for it in combat. But here's what it does. You bring yourself the fuck up. And you lose your skirt. So all those screenshots of this game and shit where you see 2B without a skirt is from people fucking self-destructing. Um. And yeah, you fucking... Fucking, just, you just have no health afterwards. But you can get chips later that give you health regen. Probably helps with that shit, but yeah. Yeah, there you go. Just some cosmetic shit to show off, I guess. I imagine the, the fucking self destruct does damage enemies close by. I can't imagine the range is super huge though, and like, uh, I, I just don't see it being a, a practical, like, option in combat. <laughs> Seems kind of dumb to me, I don't know, personally, but whatever. Anyway, unfortunately it's time to end stream. Yes. <laughs> 
unfortunately. Yeah. Sucks that the stream got interrupted by lightning, but um Yeah. That's, uh, can't really do much about that. Um, but I'm glad to like, you know I'm just happy you could be playing this game again, man. Especially, you know, in a place where I can share it with people. Just fucking love this game. Um, I definitely highly recommend you guys play this game for yourselves. It is a very good game. Along with the first one. Along with the Replicant. Um, well, yeah. Next stream will be tomorrow. Where I will be streaming for the king with Gami. We will be picking up from where we left off last week. Uh, and hopefully we can actually beat it. Maybe. I don't. I, I'll be real. Don't. Let Gabi hear this, but I don't have high hopes. I do. I do not have high hopes. I'm pretty sure we're gonna. If if we even get to the Demon King in his castle, uh, pretty sure he's just gonna fucking stomp us. So yeah, keep an eye out for that tomorrow. That's tomorrow at 8 p.m. Eastern. Um, if you want to keep up with my bullshit, uh, you want to watch more more of my streams. Uh, in the future, just follow the Twitch channel. I appreciate it if you did. And um, you can also follow my Twitter at Caribbean underscore cruise to keep up with my bullshit. I post a schedule on Twitter every week and I also post my go live and shit. And if I have technical difficulties like today with the fucking lightning and power outage, uh, I'll post about that on there too. Um, I guess that's not really technical difficulties. It's more like natural difficulties. But whatever. You get the idea. Um, so, yeah. Uh, next near stream will be... Thursday, I think, is when I scheduled it. Um, yeah. That will be on Thursday. Um, tomorrow will be, like I said, for the King of Coffee. No, I'll fucking see you guys tomorrow at 8 p.m. Eastern. Bye-bye.